Last night, House Democrats publicly demanded an immediate investigation by the Government Oversight Committee into Donald Trump's ousted National Security Advisor, former General Michael Flynn. The treasonous Flynn was forced to resign in the middle of the night after it became clear that he lied about potentially illegal collusion with top Russian officials before Trump took office. House Republicans have responded by pretending there's nothing wrong with the man in charge of the president's National Security Council for the last 24 days calling Russia's ambassador before taking office to discuss the current administration's incoming sanctions and then lying about the call to everyone. Box reports. It's taking care of itself, Chaffetz told reporters Tuesday, according to Politico's Kyle Cheney, adding that further investigation would be up to the House Intelligence Committee. But Republican House Intelligence Committee Chair David Nunn said Tuesday that his committee won't look into conversations between Trump and Flynn, according CNN's Manu Raju. Nunn cited executive privilege a privilege typically claimed by the president for withholding information in the public interest. Emphasis ours, Rep. David Noon's executive privilege excuse is absurd. General Flynn's resignation terminated his right to claim executive privilege and avoid testifying to Congress or in front of the judiciary branches of government. Nunn's refusal to acknowledge this basic fact shows a willingness to ignore the most fundamental part of American democracy. Our system of checks and balances. House Government Oversight Committee Chairman Jason Chaffetz is also unwilling to fulfill his sworn duty of holding the executive branch of government accountable. He wants to avoid making a fellow Republican look bad, so he is pretending that nothing is wrong with General Michael Flynn's multiple federal law breaches. These are not minor breaches either. They landed his communications inside of legitimately authorized national security wiretaps before he even took office. Chaffetz has some nerve actually saying, that General Flynn's resignation takes care of the problem. The problem is that Trump chose a known Putinist as his most trusted advisor and gave him access to the secrets of our intelligence agencies and the White House which has led to intelligence agencies purposefully withholding information from the White House for fear that Flynn was passing on that information. Contact Representative Nunns and instruct him that General Flynn's lost executive privilege compel him to start an immediate investigation into the Trump administration. Truth Monitor contributed to this report. Its news exposed signing off.